Good morning. Welcome to session number five, intermediate full body home workouts. We'll be beginning our workout with a dynamic warm up. The first exercise is jump knee tucks. Let's begin. We'll be doing 10 to 12 reps. One, two, three, four. Very nice. Five, six, seven. Make sure you land on your toes and you don't use your complete foot because that can injure, or that can send a shock to your lumbar region. So make sure you land on your toes when you doing this exercise okay let's move on to our next exercise which is jump lunges please move to the side so that people can see all right so we will be doing 10 reps very nice nice and steady if you find the jumping is a little bit difficult you can do a standing lunge workout as well for that you need to do at least 15 to 16 reps we're doing 10 reps here very nice keep your torso spray nice and steady very nice very nice one more round. Done. Okay. Let's begin our next warm up, which is in and out jumps. Let's begin. Okay. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five. Please move to the side so that people can see the form as well. All right. Make sure when you're doing this exercise, you engage and you tighten your core muscles so you won't injure yourself. This is a very good full body warm up before starting any workout. Very nice. We're doing, let's do two more reps. One, two, and done. This is our end of our warm up session. You can go for two rounds, three rounds, depending on your fitness level. We are here only doing one round. Let's begin our workout session. Let's begin around one. The first workout is push-up punch. Let's see how it's done. Get into a normal push-up position. Do a push-up and then punch out. Very nice. Two. Three. Very nice. Four. Keep breathing, guys. Five. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Very nice. Breathe in. Breathe out. Let's move to the side so that everybody can see the form from the side as well. Very nice. We'll be doing 15 reps. You can do 12 reps here. Uh, you can also do 20 reps if you want to increase the difficulty level. Very nice. This is a very good exercise for your pectoral muscles, for your core. It works for great uh, for stabilizing your core as well. Very nice. All right, let's four more reps. One, yep. Two, three, four, and we're done. Let's move on to our double pulse squat jump. Let's begin, let's see how it's done. So you'll be doing one partial rep and then second jump. Very nice, partial jump. Make sure you keep breathing. Very nice, and land on your toes. Very nice, keep going, keep going. We will be doing 15 reps. Keep your torso straight. Amazing. One, two. So you'll be doing two reps. The second one is a jump. Then you're gonna count as a one rep. Very nice. That's it. Very nice. Okay, let's move on to our next exercise. You can rest here for five seconds or 10 seconds if you feel exhausted. If you wanna jump into an exercise, you can just directly get into it. All right. Let's uh, start with our Russian twist. You can also cross your leg if you want to get more stability. And if you feel comfortable, you can do it like this. You can also hold a weight like a dumbbell or maybe a bag or maybe a water bottle just to add more resistance. Very nice. Keep your core engaged throughout the motion. That is very important. Very nice. Keep breathing, guys. Keep breathing. Almost there. Almost there. We'll be doing 15 twists. Very nice. Let's do two more. One, two, three, four. And we're done. Very nice. Okay, let's move on to our next exercise, which is donkey kicks. Let's get into the position. 
Again, after every exercise, you can take a rest for five to 10 seconds. It's okay to take a rest. Okay. Get into a cat camel position, stre stretch your leg, make sure you engage your hamstrings and your gluteus muscle and you just start kicking up. Very nice. One, up, two, three. Keep your legs straight all the time. Four, five, six, seven. This is a very good exercise if you want to tone your gluteus, if you want to tone your legs. It's a very good exercise. We'll be doing total 15 reps, 10 kicks one side. You can go for 20 reps. You can also go for 12 reps. Let's begin. All right. One. Very nice. Two. Breathe in. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Keep your legs straight all the time. Very nice. Nice and steady. Keep going. Very nice. You're doing great. You're doing great. Very nice. Keep going. Keep going, guys. Very nice. And we are done. This is the end of round one. We'll be doing two rounds here. Again, if you want to increase the difficulty level, you can go for three rounds. After finishing your round one, we'll be taking a rest for 30 seconds. And then we're going to start our round two. Okay, let's begin our round two. We'll be doing push-up punch again. We'll be doing 15 reps. Let's take our position and let's begin our round two. Okay, push-up, nice and easy punch. Very nice. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Very nice. Keep breathing, guys. This is our round two. Very nice. Stay strong. Very nice, very nice. Keep going, keep going. Let's do 15 reps. Very nice. You're doing great, you're doing great. Just keep working at it, very nice. Keep pushing yourself, guys. Keep pushing yourself. Okay, let's move on to our next exercise. Double pulse squat jump. Let's see how it's done. All right, round two. We'll be doing 15 reps. One, two, one. That's a one rep. Two, very nice. Three, keep it steady, guys. Four, land it on your toes. It's very important. Amazing. Well done. Eight. Nine. You can also do 12 reps if you like. 10. 11. 12. 13. Your glutes, your hamstrings, your quads must be burning, which is a very good sign. Okay, well done. You can take a rest here for five seconds and then we're going to move into our Russian twist. You can cross your legs for stability if you like or if you want to hold your legs together that is perfectly fine as well again you can hold a weight of any kind if you want to increase the difficulty very nice this is a great way to strengthen your core also your quad quadriceps as well very nice keep breathing guys keep breathing don't give out just yet the worst is almost over very nice very nice you're doing great guys very nice okay you can take a rest here for five to ten seconds then we're gonna move on to our next exercise donkey kicks again get into a cat camel position okay very nice slowly extend your leg very nice now start kicking up very nice go more up very nice very nice yes three we'll be doing ten each side five Six, make sure you keep your legs straight, tight, and, and your uh, gluteus engaged throughout the motion. Very nice. All right, let's switch legs. 10 more reps, 10 more reps, guys. Almost done, almost there. Don't give up just yet. Three, four, five, very nice. Keep breathing, keep breathing, guys. Last two reps. One, 
two and we are done this is end of round two again you can take a rest for 30 seconds or 40 seconds after this we will be beginning our cool down okay let's begin our stretches now the first stretch is child pose we'll be doing a little variation here let's see how it's done okay just get on your knees relax okay let's begin so just a normal child pose just like very nice now move to a side a little so that we can stretch our lats as well and as well as our core very nice hold there for 10 seconds hold it hold it okay let's move to the other side slowly very nice move it very nice hold it there keep breathing guys don't hold your breath it's very important very nice and relax okay that's the end of our set one you can take a rest here for two to three seconds or you can just begin the second round all right let's stretch hold there for 10 seconds hold it hold it very nice keep breathing keep breathing okay let's move to the second side very nice very nice move to your right yes stay there hold it for 10 seconds you can hold it for 15 seconds or maybe 20 seconds depending on your flexibility and we are done very nice this is our first stretch let's move on to our next stretch which is a gluteus stretch you just need to lay down on your back fold both of your legs together all right very nice now try to bring amazing hold it there this is a very good stretch if your job includes a lot of sitting or if you are uh, inactive for a long time this is the best stretch for you but again don't overdo it don't overstretch yourself start from a uh, smaller range of motion and then you can in increase gradually so this is a very good stretch to uh, improve your mobility of your gluteus muscle your hamstrings your quads and also your lumbar region as well very nice hold it for 20 seconds okay let's switch legs cross your legs like that and then you just move very nice hold it there hold it there hold it hold it for 20 seconds we'll be doing two sets of these hold it you can hold it for 10 seconds or 20 seconds very nice let's move on to the next okay relax you can rest here for five seconds and then just jump into it very nice okay Hold it, hold it for 10 seconds or 20 seconds. Keep breathing, don't hold your breath while stretching. That's very important. You're doing great, keep breathing, keep breathing. And switch, very nice, relax, okay. Bend your leg, very nice. Make sure you don't need to do any jerky movements. That's very important. Don't do or don't rush any stretch. Make sure you do it with the proper care and proper form. You're doing great. Almost done, guys. Almost done. Stay with us. Very nice. Keep breathing. Don't hold your breath. Stay there. Stay there. And relax. This is the end of stretch two let's uh, get up and let's begin our stretch number three you guys did a very good job so we're gonna do what you need to do is hug it out <laughs> that's the name of our next stretch hug stretch all right very nice can you move to the side so the people can see so basically just trying to hug yourself and hold hold your position there this is a very good stretch for your lats for your deltoids and even your triceps as well very nice just stay there all this stretch for 20 seconds keep breathing don't hold your breath very nice stay there stay there very nice okay relax 
relax for four to five seconds. We're gonna do another round. Okay, let's begin. Very nice. Hold it there. Keep breathing, keep breathing. And we are done. This is our end of session number five, week one. For second week, you'll be repeating the same workout you did for week one. After this, we'll be posting more workouts your way. Thank you so much for watching. Do subscribe to our channel. Share it with your friends and family. Till then, see ya.